Thank you for the star. This is Live.me, a video streaming app. Victoria from Leeds uses it to chat online. But last year, she started getting abuse and threats. Photos of her home were posted online and she was dared to try and leave the house. One user threatened to force himself on her. She was even told, go kill yourself. And her address was posted on Twitter as a house to burgle. This has legit just ruined my life. Like I used to be an outgoing person. And now I'm just getting there, trying to get back to my old self. With more people using smartphones and social media, police are getting more reports of malicious communications offences. That can include threats sent by online trolls, abusive text messages, pornographic images and cyber bullying. Research by the BBC has found more than 200 offences are being recorded by police in England and Wales every day. The number has risen by 85% over the past two years. I think this is the tip of an iceberg. I think as policing and society changes into the digital age, this is only going to increase. And providers, government, law enforcement and users all need to get ready how we protect people more effectively and then how we bring the criminals to justice. With the support of her family, Victoria is slowly getting her confidence back. So far, no one has been arrested over the threats she received. Emma Glasby, BBC News, Leeds.